I have a OnePlus 8T here. I'm going to show you how to transfer photos and vi videos directly from your 8T to the Chromebook, okay? And we're going to be saving the photos and videos to the hard drive of the Chromebook. I'm not talking about anything to do with uh, Google Drive or Google Photos, okay? So we are going to be using a cable here. Now take note, with the AT here, you get this cable, charging cable here. It's a USB-C to USB-C. The thing is, with my Chromebook, I don't have a USB-C or a Thunderbolt 3 connector. So what I have to use is a traditional USB-A to USB-C, okay? So let me go ahead and connect this into my USB port. Now let me go ahead and grab my AT here. Let me pl plug this in. Now I will have to sign in, so let me go ahead and sign in and then as soon as you log in i mean nothing happens here okay this chromebook is not a windows computer okay you, usually you hear like a sound so for the uh, at here we need to do is slide down now you have to find this right here okay under no the uh, notification is a android system here okay charging this device by usb go ahead and tap on that the thing is if this didn't show up just go ahead and unplug it and then plug it back in okay and wait a few seconds so this shows up okay so now it says charging this device via usb tap for more options so you got to tap down here and you can see that it's selected no data transfer what you need to do is go up here with this file transfer so let's tap on that and as soon as i tap on this this uh the files window here pops up okay if the files window doesn't pop up automatically on your chromebook uh, just go down here you can click on that and then click on uh, files right there right there okay so the files window is here now if I look over here I'm not sure if you can see this or not but down here it says one plus like two a I mean whatever I mean I know that's my uh, AT here because that's what I have connected so let me go ahead and click on this right here now next thing all my photos and videos would be under my DCIM folder which is right there DCIM so let's double click on that and now double click on camera and now you can see I only have like, what do I have? Like four photos, four JPEGs, and one video, which is an MP4. So now in order for me to save it to actual hard drive, what I have to look is over here on the left side. See now under my files, now everything under my files is your hard drive. That's your Chromebook's hard drive, okay? And everything under my files. So you only have one folder down here that downloads. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create another folder here. I'm just going to go ahead and um, go to my files. I'm going to double click my mouse pad so I can create a new folder. Okay, so I'm going to go to new folder here and I'll call this one, uh, we'll just call it 8, 8T. Now all I'm going to do is drag and drop whichever one I want. I can drag and drop that right into my 8T uh, folder. You can see it copying. Or, I mean, you can go ahead and do the whole shebang. I'll go ahead and highlight all of these and I'll drag and drop it into my new 8T folder. Give that one second. You should, okay, so we can see it copying right now. So give that one second, and now it's done. Now if I click on my AT, AT folder here, now here's all my uh, videos and photos. So I'll go ahead and disconnect this. Now you can see I have everything, uh, my uh, photos and videos that are actually saved on my hard drive of my Chromebook. So pretty simple. Questions, issues, comment below. Good luck.